Now, this is quite a discovery. Fragments of a biblical scroll, along with other relics, have been found in desert caves in Israel. Beneath the earth's surface lies a world cloaked in darkness, yet full with wonders waiting to be explored. In recent years, drone technology has revolutionized the way we explore these realms, offering us a bird's view into the heart of caves that no one was supposed to see. Join us as we uncover the secrets of these remarkable underground landscapes, revealing ancient mysteries and unlocking new insights into the geology and biodiversity of our planet's hidden treasures. Our Ginger Z takes us to one of the most magnificent buried treasures deep inside a mountain. It Number 10. Firstly, let's talk about this incredible cave located in the Quan Binh province of Vietnam called Son Dong. Beautiful views that look like scenes straight up from the movie Avatar are hidden from the public eye due to its remote location and the need for specialized equipment and permits. This is where our trusty companion, a drone, comes in to fully explore it. While venturing through this cave, visitors are treated to a surreal landscape of colossal stalagmites and stalactites, some of which are over 70 meters tall. Flowing through the heart of Sundon Cave is an underground river, which helped carve out the cave over millions of years. One of the most awe-inspiring features of this cave is its colossal chambers, which are large enough to accommodate entire city blocks and skyscrapers. Sondong Cave is recognized as the largest cave in the world by both volume and cross-sectional area. Only a limited number of tours are permitted each year, which makes it a rare and exclusive experience. Number 9. Now, let us tell you about this amazing drone find, the Grand Aquifero Maya, located in the Yucatan Peninsula of Mexico. It's an expansive underwater cave system that holds significant cultural and ecological importance. This network of submerged passages and chambers is regarded as one of the most extensive flooded cave systems in the world. It is home to a diverse array of aquatic life forms and uh, contains invaluable archaeological treasures including ancient Mayan artifacts and human remains. The exploration of the Gran Aquifero Maya continues to reveal new insights into the region's rich history and natural heritage, making it a subject of fascination for scientists, archaeologists and adventurers alike. Mapping and exploring the Gran Aquifero Maya presents significant challenges due to its vast size, intricate passages and often hazardous conditions. Cave divers must navigate narrow tunnels, strong currents and low visibility while contending with the risk of flooding and other dangers. Number 8. Imagine just going on an adventure of cave exploring and then finding out it was full of skeletal remains. Horror scene, isn't it? The Cave of Horror is situated in the cliffs of the Judean Desert, near the Dead Sea in Israel. It gained its ominous name due to being full of human skeletons dating back to the Roman era. In a recent excavation led by the Israel's Antiquities Authority and Hebrew University of Jerusalem, archaeologists uncovered a well-preserved ancient scroll made of parchment. The scroll was found buried deep within the cave's sediment, where it had remained undisturbed for nearly 2,000 years. The contents of the ancient scroll have not been fully revealed to the public yet as experts are still in the process of carefully deciphering and analyzing its text. Number 7. Through the lens of a drone, some remarkable sights could be captured, such as the one we are going to talk about next, the discovery of ancient cave paintings in Patagonia, South America. Radiocarbon dating of the cave paintings suggest they were created over 9,000 years ago. Isn't that impressive? The paintings are believed to have been created by early hunter-gatherer societies who inhabited the region during the late Pleistocene and early Holocene periods. Around 890 paintings were found on the walls of Hanul 1 cave, ranging from simple geometric shapes and handprints to more complex representations of animals, humans and mythical figures. The discovery of these ancient cave paintings provides valuable insights into the cultural practices, spiritual beliefs, and artistic expression of South America's early inhabitants. Number 6. The Guatari Cave, discovered by accident by a group of workers in 1939, 
has captured the attention of archaeologists once again as new research endeavors began in October 2019. Nine Neanderthal remains were found inside a cave in the coastal town San Felice. One of the most significant discoveries made here are the remains of an individual known as the Marino Man. These remains, consisting of a partial skull and other skeletal fragments, are believed to belong to a Neanderthal who lived approximately 50,000 years ago. The other eight remains are estimated to range from 50,000 to 68,000 years old, with the oldest potentially dating back 19,000 to 100,000 years. Today, Guatari Cave is recognized as an important archaeological site and is protected as a national monument by the Italian government. Number 5. Drones can uncover some incredible things, like in this case, these marvelous cave clouds that were found in South China's Guangxi Zhuang Autonomous Region. This special kind of mineral deposit covers around 300 square meters of the cave. Dispersed across seven pools within the cave, each pool resembles the shape of a pumpkin or loaf of bread. Zhang Yonghai, a senior engineer with the institute, mentioned that the conditions for the formation of cave clouds are quite challenging. He highlighted that the surrounding rock of the cave primarily consists of dolomite, and it's not typical to find karst caves formed by dolomite. How these clouds are formed still remains a mystery. That's so fascinating, don't you think? A newly discovered cave in British Columbia could be the largest in Canada. Number four. Next up, we have this incredible footage captured by a drone, the largest cave in Canada. According to Canadian geologist Catherine Kingston, the cave poses significant technical challenges due to the initial 100 meters of vertical rock. The entrance pit to the cave spans approximately 100 meters in length and 60 meters in width. Although the mist from a waterfall makes it uh, difficult to gauge its depth accurately, preliminary assessments suggest it is at least 135 meters deep. The formation developed beneath glaciers for possibly tens of thousands of years, making it challenging to determine the cave's true age immediately. The cave lay hidden in plain sight, its opening visible to anyone hiking in northern Israel, but its treasure was hidden deep within secret for more than 2,000 years, waiting for a group of curious cave divers to stumble upon the valuable hoard. Uh, number three, you never know what kinds of things could be hidden inside a cave. Well, at least until the depths are fully explored. With the help of a drone, we could uncover all kinds of secrets or find all kinds of treasures hidden far from human grasp. Zakai, accompanied by his father and a friend, both fellow members of the Israeli caving club, was exploring a secluded stalactite cave in northern Israel when he caught sight of a gleaming silver object. Crafted during the rule of Alexander the Great in the late 4th century BC, the two silver coins feature an image of the famed conqueror on one side and a depiction of Zeus seated on his throne. Recently, divers exploring the waters of the ancient Roman port of Caesarea stumbled upon a trove of nearly 2,000 gold coins. These coins, estimated to be around 1,000 years old, originate from various regions surrounding the Mediterranean Sea. Number 2. Get this by reviewing the recording taken by a drone camera. A team of Chinese scientists found a random sinkhole in the middle of nowhere that no one was supposed to see. According to the Xinhua News Agency, this sinkhole was 192 meters deep and had a forest at the bottom. On Friday, May 6, a group of cave explorers descended into the sinkhole, revealing three cave entrances within the abyss. Additionally, they encountered ancient trees, towering at a height of 131 feet. In southern China, karst topography prevails, characterized by its dramatic sinkholes and fantastical caves. Number 1. A drone captured a horrifying sight which will leave you to never want to explore a cave again. No one was supposed to see this, but this drone captured what it looks like to be a cave jam-packed with wooden coffins filled with human remains. The intriguing tradition of stacking caskets in caves along the cliffs of Anshun, located in Guangzhou province in southwest China, is thought to have been practiced uh, since ancient times. It is believed that this way of honoring their deceased loved ones brought their souls to heaven. 
According to one legend, the practice originated from the desire of some to eventually return to their homeland, leading them to stack their coffins in the caves instead of burying them. On the other hand, some stories suggest that the tradition began as a precaution against floods in the area, with coffins stored in caves to shield them from potential damage. Which drone footage left the biggest impression on you? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you liked the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more. See you next time. Bye.